Hi friends! Today is the fourth Sunday in Advent. Christmas is very near. In the middle of all this excitement, do you remember who we are getting ready for? That's right, baby Jesus. Have you ever had good news to share? We might be told good news by a friend or hear good news on TV or with a text message. When a woman named Mary needed to know about some good news, an angel visited her. I don't sound much like an angel, but I have found someone who does sound a lot more like the angel Gabriel. <gasps> Hi, Gabriel. Do you have some news for me? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mary, Mary, I have good news for you. We're going to have a baby and there's more. Your baby will be called God's own son and he will change the world forever. <gasps> Oh, that is good news for Mary. She's going to have a baby, and her very special baby is the Son of God. When this baby arrives on earth, some incredible things are going to happen. Let's read the scripture for today. It comes from the book of Luke, chapter 1, verses 35 through 38. The angel answered, The Holy Spirit will come to you. The power of the Most High God will cover you. So the Holy One that is born will be called the Son of God. Your relative Elizabeth will have a child even though she is old. People thought she could not have children, but she has been pregnant for six months now. That's because what God says will always come true. I serve the Lord, Mary answered. May it happen to me just as you said it would. Then the angel left her. We like to share good news with others, don't we? We like to hear good news as well. Jesus' birth was the best news ever, and God wanted to share that news. Do you know how God shared the good news of Jesus' birth? God used angels to tell a group of shepherds. Remember, we placed them in our nativity last week. The shepherds told everyone they could find the good news. The angels told Mary and Joseph the good news about God's Son. The angels wanted to share the good news with everyone. This week, let's put the angel Gabriel, Mary and Joseph into our shoebox nativity. Look what we've done so far to our shoebox. We've cleaned the mess, we've decorated, and prepared a place for God to give us the most important gift ever given on Christmas. The baby Jesus is the Son of God, and with God all things are possible. Before we pray, turn to two other people and share the good news that God loves them, and tell them that anything is possible with God. Let us pray. Praise to you, O oh God, for sending your only son Jesus to earth as a little baby. Thank you for giving us a voice to share the good news of your love with others. Amen. That's it for this week, guys. I'll see you on Christmas Eve. Bye.